dive into the topic. And first, we're going to discuss about this organ. And at first, we're going to say, before that, I want to start with the cube. First two is going to be the easy one, and next two is going to be hard. At first two, for the first for the first question, this is this is the reward. For the second question, this is the reward. And the third one, this is the reward. For the fourth one, this is the reward. This two may seem so small, but it's also a reward. Number one, what is the unit of life? Anybody? What is the unit of life? Shannon is not included in this because he knows about everything. What is the unit of life? Please. And number seven, 
the functions. Apart from the bile secretion, this organ, this organ functions have many functions like uh, number one, it destroys the any old and uh, maybe a defective or a blood cells and uh, number two it stores the glucose as a glycogen or it may disperse or scatters the glucose molecules into the bloodstream with the help of pancreatic gland and number three it stores the fat soluble vitamins ions and so on and number five is that it is the most important function of this organ then that is the detoxification of the toxic substances maybe that's in our blood in our body and whatever it is and number 5 it involves in the it involves in the synthesis and that it is related with the detoxification of the toxic substances like ammonia nh4 amino acids these are unnecessary amino acids and this organ breaks this ammonia into urea and you know kidney can't uh, be uh, kidney can't excrete uh, or kidney can't excrete the ammonia in the same form so the, uh, the this organ helps to the kidney by breaking this ammonia into urea and then uh, this organ transfer transports this to the kidney for the process of excretion and that's it and this is the time for the facts this organ it contains 10% of 10% uh, of facts it is made up of 10% uh, it is fully made up of facts and number 2 is uh, it contains It contains you won't believe that 96 percentage of water. It contains 96 percentage of water. This water inside the cells and in the blood. You understand? And I find and the third one it is the largest organ. This organ is the is the largest glandular organ of human body and is the second largest organ besides our skin. It is bigger than the brain and it is all it is the second large uh, second largest organ than or skin number 3 and four multi functions this organ simultaneously performs over 200 important functions for our body some of these important functions include the supplying of glucose to the brain it supplies glucose to the brain and uh, combating infections and storing the nutrients combating infections infections caused by toxic substances or in the bacteria viruses etc etc and uh, storing the nutrients I said that the, it stores the fat-soluble vitamins, ions, and also the nutrients because of, uh, vitamins, ions are one of kind of nutrient. Yes, and it's uh, it contains. Uh, yes, I, as I said, liver is made up of uh, this organ is made up of ten percent of fat and contains of about ten percent of fat. So it's called as a fatty, fatty. Yes. And it stores the iron. This organ is important vitamin and the nutrient from the food we eat, and it stores them up for when it needed them later. If anybody, any person is caused with an anemia, the lack of nutrient is a uh, nutrient called iron. At that uh, at the time, it, uh, this organ helps to cure, helps to try to cure this. And as before, I said detoxification. This uh, this organ detoxifies the harmful things we take with, uh, like in alcohol and drugs, toxic substances in the alcohol and also in the drugs. Without the without the liver body, the uh, body cannot process these items. And creator of blood. This organ creates the blood that circulates our in our body. In fact, the liver start producing the blood from we born. Without the liver, there would be no blood. And no life. Do you understand? Without blood, no life. And, and the, it is the last. It is the amazing one. Previously I said it, but once more I repeat it. It is. A, it regenerates. It has a very uh, massive power to regenerate itself. This organ has amazing ability to regenerate itself, making liver transplant possible. Yes, transplant possible. And uh, when people donate half their liver, liver, the remaining part of the liver regenerates the section 
that he removed. If we transparent this part of a liver to anybody, if they, and then there is no, no there is nothing to do, then it uh, regenerates automatically here. At last, this is the time for the life, it, and, it is, and this is not going to be like a CPR. What is body yeah. mass? Body mass index. Body mass index. Yeah, that's right answer. Body mass index. For what it is used? To find. To find the weight. Yes. Uh, to find that. How do I do that? I know I'm fat. Yes, I know I'm fat. Uh, am I right to am I right to my uh, am I right in am I, am I right in my body weight for my with my height? With my age? No. At first, uh, this, uh, this BMI helps to know our, know our proper weight for our age and for our height. I am 174 centimeter and approximately at last before 3 days, 82 kgs. This is my height and this is my weight. Okay? And how can I, how can we find it? At first, you have, uh, you have weight in kgs. Weight in, I am 82. That's for example. And my height in meters, I am 174 centimeter. It means 1.7 meters. And finally, yep, this is my height. I am in the rate of 27.1. My BMI rate is 27.1. Yes. Now we'll see about that. At first, underweight category. If you are below 18.5, you are in the category of underweight. And if you are 18.5 to 24.9, if your BMI rate is 18.5 to 24.9, you are in the category of normal weight. And if you are in the category of 29.9, mistake of overweight. I am mistake of overweight, I know. And finally, if your BMI rate is greater than greater than 30. Obesity. If you want to check my BMI rate, here is the 20, oh, 27.1. My height is 174 centimeter, and my height is. Oh, okay. Thank you so much. Thank you.